I can do this. Oh God. Hi, name's Jonas Urbanas. Good luck spelling that. And this is my very first vlog episode. Now this is my very first time doing anything like this, me being in front of a camera and just talking to you. I have done a couple of Instagram stories there and there, um, but I've never done anything like this. So this is scary as hell for me. But one of the main reasons I am doing this is actually to get over that fear. Um, mm. Another reason I'm doing this vlogging is I actually do this for myself. Uh, more than anything because I do want to be able to reflect on my journey uh, to see uh, the progress that I've made uh, you know in the years to come to see how crap my first episode was uh, and just hopefully um, along the way I'll be able to learn from a lot of mistakes that I've done uh, and at the same time people that are actually viewing these videos will be able to learn from my mistakes even better um, and also I really want to help uh, like-minded people who are on a similar journey you know in a young startup don't know where to start um, don't know much about the industry you know the nitty-gritty things that come into actually managing a team you know running a company uh, you know and getting that traction and all that stuff. I know I needed that because uh, When I started what really helped was me following people like Gary V, Tony Robbins, Tom Bilyeu uh, Which is shared the journey and it felt like I had mentors along the way now I'm not saying I want to be a mentor to you guys, but as I said before if you can learn from my mistakes uh, and if me sharing my insights and my experiences will help you at any way that is just a massive massive bonus to me doing these videos. A bit about myself, I am a digital designer and marketer. I am a founder of a company called Hoops Connect which is an app that helps people organize, manage and discover a variety of sporting events near them as well as we help sports organizations and sports people uh, to build up their brands and the recognition they deserve. I've been working on my startup for, well, let's be honest, I've been working about this for about four to five years, but I've been really, really working on it for about a year. Um, so there is a lot of stuff that I wish I had recorded. I wish I could have, could have shared back then, sort of in real time, um, but that knowledge is still there. So if you ever have any questions, if you ever have any concerns, in terms of how to start a startup and you know what actually it takes because it takes a lot and you get punched in the face a lot um, I'm here uh, and I'll try my best uh, to give my best answers to you guys and give you the best value that I can personally I know not many people if any uh, will be watching this which is honestly really great for me I feel a bit less pressure uh, to do this perfectly. What we'll do is we'll show a couple of uh, insights of our trip to London where we met up with a couple of our ambassadors and uh, new partners which is very exciting for us. Big things coming this year which is another reason why I'm doing these uh, video blogs and also just simple day-to-day -day tasks that we need to go through um, so you have a better idea of the exciting things that come into being a startup as well as the boring stuff. to go fast preparing to go and guess what Andy did what did you do Andy <laughs> <laughs>
No, I'm not. He's locked himself out in between the house and the outside, and he can't go in or out. This is perfect. <laughs> Ideally, Danny will be finished at 1.30, so we have time to go to um, Sobe, yeah. Yeah. and actually to like, like 2 like 2.30 or something. Yeah. And then, yeah, now I'm looking for finish strong. Finish strong. They got some food then go out. Oh yeah, we do need to eat sometimes, don't we? <laughs> Yeah, the more diversity we have, the more sort of the better we can make a decision later on. Because we, as I said, like we're very new to the so we can have less for us. But I do. we can have it as a web-based thing, so when we take it out of the app and yeah. kind of have like a placeholder for. Yeah. He wrote in himself that he's going to be web-based because he you know, communicated that to him. Make sure the platform is awesome and great and everybody's happy with it, right? Mm. And not have the pressure of us going bust because we don't have the money. We've yeah. got the media side to back that up, right? Yeah. And we're building a relationship as well, yeah. which is very key because we want, you know... It's to like a form. Yeah. Free from business attack. It's our business tried. <laughs> oh, fee sports ain't nothing to fuck with. Thank you so much for watching this video. I kind of deeply hope that nobody did um, because I feel like it's going to be crap to start but we have to start some way, right? Um, but I kind of still have to do this, you know, subscribe, comment, do you know what? Even if, even if you don't subscribe, I'm fine with that. Comment, that's the one thing I really want. Um, feedback on it. I want to learn this. Uh, I want to know what you want um, and hopefully getting these videos better every single week. Um, so if you did watch this, you're a bit of a weirdo, but I thank you for that. Um, I hope that you'll be there next time when I'm going to be doing this. Uh, but for the time being, peace out. I'm out. Oh, opportunity feels like it's throbbing. <laughs> I don't want to inside myself. <laughs> we should stop now. <laughs> no, I, I just think it's. Not, I just think it's the right combination of it's got scope to go big, but at the moment it's small. So we, <laughs> <laughs> hey. I'm done with both of you. <laughs>